Welcome back to Kittens and Crochet YouTube channel. If you haven't checked out any of my videos before, go on my playlists and check out some of my other tutorials. For this tutorial, we're going to be making this monkey baby security blanket. As you see, Buttons is making a very early appearance in this video. Um, what you'll need is at least two colors of yarn. I'm using Red Heart Super Saver. Um, the colors I'm using is Buff and Cafe Latte. You can use any colors or equivalent yarn. You'll also need a thin black yarn or crochet thread for the eyes and the nose and the mouth. You'll need two yarn needles, one for the thinner yarn and one for the regular yarn. You'll need a four and a half millimeter crochet hook, scissors, a marker, and pins for when we attach the ears and the face. You'll also need some stuffing. So um, let's go ahead and get started. If you like this video, go ahead and give me a like and subscribe to my page. If you like this tutorial, check out some of my other tutorials. So we're going to go ahead and start making the head of the monkey. I also forgot to add at the beginning that I made a Facebook group under the name Kittens and Crochet where you guys can add pictures of the creations you've made using my tutorials and show off different colors that you used and different ideas. So to get started, we're going to make a magic circle with six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Next, we're going to put two single crochet in each of these six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Okay, so now you have 12 stitches around. For the third row, we're going to do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the next stitch. So, one in the first and then two in the second. And we're just going to repeat that all the way around. So, one and then two. One and then two, one and then two, one and two, one. and two. So now you have 18 stitches around. For row four, we're going to do one single crochet in the first two stitches and then two single crochet into the third stitch. So one in the first, one in the second, and two in the third. And then we're just going to repeat this all the way around. So one in the first, 
one in the second, and two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, and two in this last stitch. Okay, and you should now have 24 stitches around. For row five, we're gonna do one single crochet in the first three stitches and then two single crochet into the fourth stitch. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then two in this fourth stitch. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and two in the fourth, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and two in the fourth, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and two in the fourth, One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and two in the fourth. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then two in this final stitch. So you should now have 30 stitches around. For row six, we're gonna do one single crochet in the first four stitches and then two single crochet in the fifth stitch. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two in the fifth. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two in the fifth. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two in the fifth. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two in the fifth, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two in the fifth, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two in this last stitch. And you should now have 36 stitches around. Okay, so for the next eight rows, which is seven through 14, we're just doing one single crochet in each of the 36 stitches around. So this is row seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 
16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. And that's the end of row seven. And this is row eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36, and that's the end of row 8, and this is row 9, 1, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. And that's the end of row 9. And this is row 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, <laughs> 
18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. And that's the end of row 10. And this is row 11. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. That's the end of row 11, and this is row 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. And that's the end of row 12. And this is row 13. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 
29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. And that's the end of row 13. And this is row 14. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and 36. And that is the end of row 14, which ends our eight rows even. For row 15, we're going to do one single crochet in the first four stitches, and then we're going to crochet two stitches together. So, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then we're going to crochet two stitches together. And then just repeat that. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then crochet two stitches together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then two together. Oh, you're so cute. I'm so bad. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and two together. One in the first, one in the second. One in the third, one in the fourth, and then two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then crochet your last two together. And that's the end of row 15, and you should now have 30 stitches around. For row 16, we're going to do one in the first three stitches, and then crochet two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then crochet two together. And then just repeat this. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, 
two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, and then crochet two together. And that's the end of our 16. You should now have 24 stitches around. Man, Buttons is like, Mama, you haven't recorded in forever. I miss my fans. Fans miss me. I gotta be in this video. <laughs> Jeez. Your buttons move you forward a little bit. Okay, for row 17, it's gonna be one in the first two and then crochet two together. So, one in the first, one in the second, and then crochet two together. <laughs> and then just repeat this, one in the first, one in the second, and then crochet two together. One in the first, one in the second, and crochet two together. One in the first, one in the second, and crochet two together. One in the first, one in the second, and crochet two together. One in the first, one in the second, and then crochet your last two together. And that's the end of row 17. You should now have 18 stitches around. But now we're going to take the time to stuff the head. So go ahead and get your stuffing and just start stuffing your head. Okay, so don't overly stuff it, but go ahead and get the shape. And we can add more stuffing as we go. Okay. So go ahead and take the time to stuff if you need. You can pause your video. I'm going to go ahead and move on to row 18, which is one single crochet in the first stitch and then crochet two together. So one in the first and then crochet two together. One in the first and then crochet two together. One in the first, crochet two together. One in the first, and crochet two together. One in the first, and crochet two together. One in the first, and crochet your last two together. And now you have 12 around. So you can go ahead and check out your head, see if you need to add more stuffing.
Okay. So when you're finished stuffing, row 19, which is our last row, we're going to be working in the back loops only. So you have two loops to every stitch, you're just going to be working in the back one. <clears throat> That's very important because this is how we're going to add the blanket later. So for row 19, it's going to be one single crochet in the first stitch and then crocheting two together. So in the back loops only, do one in the first. And then you're going to crochet two together. Make sure you're not pulling the stuffing through. And you're just going to repeat this all the way around. One in the first. And two together. first and two together one in the first and then crochet your last two stitches together Okay, so you can cut yourself a yarn tail and pull this through to seal the head off, or to not off that yarn. And then just check out your head, see if it's st stuffed enough or not. It's your last chance. If you need to add a little bit more stuffing, you can. Okay, so when you're done stuffing, we're going to go ahead and seal the head shut. So take your yarn needle, and you have eight stitches remaining here. You're just going to go ahead and weave in and out of them. And then go ahead and pull. Shuts the hole up. And then just on a nearby stitch, go ahead and go in. And then just go back through that little loop just to kind of knot off there. And then take your needle and go through the head and just pop out anywhere. Give it a little pull and snip it. And you have your head ready. So you can go ahead and set that aside. And next we're going to go ahead and make the mouth. So go ahead and get your other color yarn. We're going to make a magic circle with six stitches. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, three, four, five, and six. And for row two, we're gonna do two single crochet in each of the stitches. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. For row three, we're going to do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochet in the next stitch. So one in the first, and then two in the second. One in the first, and two in the second. One in the first, two in the second. One in the first, Two in the second, one in the first, two in the second, one in the first, and two in the second. So that's the end of row three, and you should have 18 stitches around. Okay, so for row four, we're gonna start out with one single crochet in the first four stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're gonna do two single crochet in the fifth stitch. One, Two. Now we're going to do one single crochet in the next eight stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we're going to do two single crochet in the next stitch. And that leaves us with four stitches. We're just going to do one single crochet in each of the four stitches. One, two, three, and four. And that's the end of row four, and you now have 20 stitches around. Row five is just going to be one row even. So one single crochet in each of the 20 stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. 
and that's the end of row five. Row six is going to be one single crochet in the first four stitches. <clears throat> one, two, three, four, and then we're going to crochet two together. Next, we're going to do one single crochet in the next eight stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then we're going to crochet two together. And that leaves us with four stitches left. We'll do one single crochet in each of those four stitches. And that's the end of row six. And you now have 18 stitches around. And you're going to go into the next stitch and slip stitch. And then leave yourself a long yarn tail. Leave it longer than normal because you're going to use it to attach the mouth and the eyes to the head. And finish off. You can go ahead and set that aside for now. And let's go ahead and move on to the eyes. To start the eye, you're going to make a magic circle with six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, Next, we're going to do two single crochet in each stitch. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. For row three, we're going to do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the second stitch. So one and then two. And we're going to repeat that all the way around. One in the first, two in the second, 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 one in the first, and two in the second. Now you have 18 stitches around. Go ahead and slip stitch into your next stitch and then chain two and then we're going to half double crochet in the same stitch we just slip stitched into and then half double crochet into the next stitch and now we're going to go ahead and cut a yarn tail and pull it through 
and then go ahead and set this eye aside. Now let's go ahead and make your second eye. To start the eye, you're gonna make a magic circle with six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, Next, we're gonna do two single crochet in each stitch. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. For row three, we're gonna do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the second stitch. So one and then two. And we're gonna repeat that all the way around. One in the first, two in the second, 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 one in the first, and two in the second. Now you have 18 stitches around. Go ahead and slip stitch into your next stitch and then chain two and then we're in a half double crochet in the same stitch we just slip stitched into and then half double crochet into the next stitch and now we're going to go ahead and cut a yarn tail and pull it through and then go ahead and set this eye aside now both eyes are complete let's go ahead and move on to the ears to start the ear we're going to make a magic circle with six stitches One, two, three, four, five, and six. For row two, we're going to put two single crochet in each stitch around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. For row three, we're going to do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the next stitch. So one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the next stitch. And we're going to repeat this all the way around. So one in the first, two in the second. One in the first, two in the second, one in the first, two in the second, one in the first, two in the second, one in the first and then two in this last stitch. So that's the end of row three and you now have 18 stitches around. Row four is gonna be one single crochet in the first two stitches and then two single crochets into the third stitch. So one single crochet in the first, one single crochet in the second, and then two single crochets into the third stitch. And we're gonna repeat this all the way around. So one in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third, one in the first, one in the second, two in the third, one in the first, one in the second, and two in this last stitch. And that's the end of row four, and you now have 24 stitches around. Row five is going to be one single crochet in the first two stitches, and then we're going to crochet two stitches together. So one single crochet in the first stitch, one single crochet in the second stitch, and then crochet two stitches together. One single crochet in the first stitch, one single crochet in the second stitch, and then crochet two stitches together and just repeat this all the way around one in the first and then the second and two together one in the first one in the second and two together one in the first one in the second two together, one in the first, one in the second, and then crochet your last two together. It's the end of row five, and you now have 18 stitches around. Row six is going to be one single crochet in the first stitch, and then crochet two together. So one in the first, and then two together. And we're just gonna repeat this all the way around. One in the first and two together. One in the first and two together. One in the first, 
the two together. One in the first. Two together. One in the first. And then crochet your last two together. And that's the end of row six, and you now have 12 stitches around. Row seven is going to be one single crochet in the first four stitches, and then crochet two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then crochet two together. And then we're going to do that one more time. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then crochet your last two together. And then go ahead into your next stitch and slip stitch. And cut yourself a yarn tail, pull it through, and go ahead and set your ear off to the side. Now let's go ahead and make your second ear. To start the ear, we're going to make a magic circle with six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, and six. For row two, we're going to put two single crochet in each stitch around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, and 12. For row three, we're gonna do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the next stitch. So one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets in the next stitch. And we're going to repeat this all the way around. So one in the first, two in the second, 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 one in the first, and then two in this last stitch. So that's the end of row three and you now have 18 stitches around. Row four is going to be one single crochet in the first two stitches and then two single crochets into the third stitch. So one single crochet in the first, one single crochet in the second, and then two single crochets into the third stitch. And we're going to repeat this all the way around. 
So one in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third. One in the first, one in the second, two in the third, one in the first, one in the second, and two in this last stitch. And that's the end of row four, and you now have 24 stitches around. Row five is going to be one single crochet in the first two stitches, and then we're going to crochet two stitches together. So one single crochet in the first stitch, one single crochet in the second stitch, and then crochet two stitches together. One single crochet in the first stitch, one single crochet in the second stitch, and then crochet two stitches together. And just repeat this all the way around. One in the first, and then the second, and two together. One in the first, one in the second, and two together. One in the first, one in the second, and two together. One in the first, one in the second, and then crochet your last two together. It's the end of row five, and you now have 18 stitches around. Row six is going to be one single crochet in the first stitch, and then crochet two together. So one in the first, and then two together. And we're just going to repeat this all the way around. One in the first, and two together. One in the first, and two together. One in the first, and two together. One in the first, two together. One in the first, and then crochet your last two together. And that's the end of row six, and you now have 12 stitches around. Row seven is going to be one single crochet in the first four stitches and then crochet two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, and then crochet two together. And then we're going to do that one more time. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, One in the fourth, and then crochet your last two together. And then go ahead into your next stitch and slip stitch. And cut yourself a yarn tail. Pull it through. And go ahead and set your ear off to the side. Now that both ears are made, let's go ahead and move on to the arms. To start the arm, we're taking the same color as the ears and we're making a magic circle with six stitches. One. 
two, three, four, five, and six. For row two, we're putting two single crochet in each of the six stitches around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Row three is going to be one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets into the second stitch. So one single crochet in the first stitch, two single crochets into the second stitch. And then we're just going to repeat this all the way around. So one in the first, two in the second, 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 one in the first, and two in the second. And that's the end of row three, and you should now have 18 stitches around. For row four, we're going to do one single crochet in the first eight stitches, and then two single crochet into the ninth stitch. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then two into the ninth. And then we're going to repeat that. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then two in this last stitch. And that's the end of row four, and you now have 20 stitches around. Row five is going to be one row even, so one single crochet in each of the 20 stitches. So one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. And 20. Row 6 is also one row even, but the, at the end of row 6, we're going to change colors to the color of the arm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. And if you don't know how to change yarn color, I will leave a link in the description for a video to show you how to do it. I'm going to go ahead and change over now. And that is the 20th stitch right there. I'm going to do one more stitch into row 7 to kind of secure that. But the marker goes right here. Now since this is going to be the inside of the hand and nobody will see it. I'm just going to tie these two yarn strings together a few times. Just don't pull too tight. Just kind of make it extra secure. Okay. So that was the end of row six. Row seven is also one row even. So one single crochet in each of the 20 stitches. I already have my first single crochet. So this is two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. For row 8, we're going to do one single crochet in the first 8 stitches, and then we're going to crochet two together. So, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then crochet two together. And then repeat one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then last two together. And that's the end of our eight, and you now have 18 stitches around. Row 9 is going to be one single crochet in the first 7, and then crochet 2 together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, and then 2 together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, and then crochet your last two together. That's the end of row nine. And you should now have 16 stitches around. Row 10 is gonna be one in the first six stitches and then crochet two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, and then crochet two together. And then repeat. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, 
one in the six, and then crochet your last two together. And that's the end of row 10, and you should now have 14 stitches around. Row 11 is going to be one single crochet in the first five stitches, and then two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, and then two together. And then repeat that. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, and then your last two together. And that's the end of our 11, and you now have 12 stitches around. For the next five rows, we're going to just be working them even. So one single crochet in each of the 12 stitches. So this is row 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. So that's the end of row 12. This is row 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So that's the end of row thirteen. This is row fourteen. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. And that's the end of row fourteen. This is row fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And 12. And that's the end of row 15. And this is row 16, which is our final row. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. Now go ahead and go into the next stitch and slip stitch and cut yourself a yarn tail. And then you can go ahead and set your arm to the side. Let's go ahead and make your second arm now. To start the arm, we're taking the same color as the ears and we're making a magic circle with six stitches. One, two, 
three, four, five, and six. For row two, we're putting two single crochet in each of the six stitches around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Row three is going to be one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochets into the second stitch. So one single crochet in the first stitch, two single crochets into the second stitch. And then we're just going to repeat this all the way around. So one in the first, two in the second, 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 one in the first, and two in the second. And that's the end of row three, and you should now have 18 stitches around. For row four, we're going to do one single crochet in the first eight stitches, and then two single crochet into the ninth stitch. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then two into the ninth. And then we're going to repeat that. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then two in this last stitch. And that's the end of row four, and you now have 20 stitches around. Row five is going to be one row even, so one single crochet in each of the 20 stitches. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and 20. Row 6 is also one row even, but the, at the end of row 6, we're going to change colors to the color of the arm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. And if you don't know how to change yarn color, I will leave a link in the description for a video to show you how to do it. I'm going to go ahead and change over now. And that is the 20th stitch right there. I'm going to do one more stitch in the row 7 to kind of secure that. But the marker goes right here. Now since this is going to be the inside of the hand and nobody will see it. I'm just going to tie these two yarn strings together a few times, just don't pull too tight. Let's kind of make it extra secure. Okay, so that was the end of row six. Row seven is also one row even. So one single crochet in each of the 20 stitches. I already have my first single crochet. So this is two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. For row eight, we're gonna do one single crochet in the first eight stitches, and then we're gonna crochet two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then crochet two together. And then repeat, one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, one in the eighth, and then last two together. And that's the end of row eight, and you now have 18 stitches around. Row nine is going to be one single crochet in the first seven, and then crochet two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, and then two together. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, and then crochet your last two together. That's the end of row nine, and you should now have 16 stitches around. Row 10 is gonna be one in the first six stitches, and then crochet two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, and then crochet two together. And then repeat. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, one in the sixth, 
and then crochet your last two together. And that's the end of row 10, and you should now have 14 stitches around. Row 11 is going to be one single crochet in the first five stitches, and then two together. So one in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, and then two together. And then repeat that. One in the first, one in the second, one in the third, one in the fourth, one in the fifth, and then your last two together. And that's the end of row 11, and you now have 12 stitches around. For the next five rows, we're going to just be working them even. So one single crochet in each of the 12 stitches. So this is row 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. So that's the end of row 12. This is row 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So that's the end of row thirteen. This is row fourteen. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. And that's the end of row fourteen. This is row fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And 12. And that's the end of row 15. And this is row 16, which is our final row. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. Now go ahead and go into the next stitch and slip stitch and cut yourself a yarn tail. And then you can go ahead and set your arm to the side. Okay, so you now have all the parts made for the monkey the eyes, the mouth, the ears, the arms, and the head. So I'm going to leave a link in the description on a video on how to add a blanket to the head. It's actually part two of the cow video, but you add the blanket the same way, so I just figured I'd use the same video. Part two for the monkey tutorial, 
which will be assembling the monkey. I'll also leave a link for that in the description. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button and subscribe. Also, I created a Facebook group called Kittens and Crochet, and my members can add pictures of creations they made. Maybe you'd use a different color. Just give some ideas for other people to use. So thank you again for watching.